All right, we're back in the car here and we're gonna just continue forward and see if we see any indication of where animals have crossed the road. As I said, there's about an inch of fresh snow that can reveal a fresh track and that's what we've seen signs of today is deer or deer have crossed the road this morning. Trying to drive about 10 miles an hour, 10 to 15 miles an hour. Uh, keeping an eye open for not just tracks, but also human tracks where humans might have gone off into the into the woods. Uh, last year when we were doing this kind of tracking, we found some illegal baits that were set uh, by following human footprints into the woods and it led to about half a dozen baited treble hooks, fish hooks, uh, that had meat wrapped around the hook so that an animal would swallow it and die slowly. So that's a good reason to do these types of track surveys is, is not only does it give us an indication of where there's wolves and, and where wolves in Wisconsin are recolonizing, but it also shows us what people are doing out in the woods as well. And uh, if anybody's out there doing anything illegal, uh, we are most certainly looking for evidence of that so we can see them prosecuted to the full extent of the law. People or person responsible for those baited hooks that we discovered last year or earlier this year actually uh, have still not been captured and we still have a reward, $1,500 reward out there for uh, anybody with information. This is a, uh, I'm gonna stop and check out this intersection because it looks like definitely animal tracks, probably deer. Let's see. an area where there's a lot of bear baits too. I remember this area well down this road. You kind of see there the, the freshness of those tracks and uh, the pointy hooves telltale sign that these are deer. That's what we've been seeing all day today is just a lot of deer tracks. A lot of people say there are no deer because the wolves have eaten them all, eaten them all but uh, we see contrary. It looks like there's some uh, rabbit tracks here too you can tell the, 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 the gate of the hop of the, the rabbit there and all four prints that are showing it's pretty pretty cool too it's riding right on the crust of the uh, snow It wouldn't be uncommon for us to find wolf tracks where there's deer tracks uh, because of deer being the primary principal pay, prey species for wolves in this area. So that's another reason why I've been checking out all the deer tracks is because I figure eventually we're going to see where wolves have followed the deer. 